got a, I got a lot of stress on my mind. It's a nice day to go. Yeah, I got a line. I'm a caller. The whole team. All right, guys, this is Team Hard Life Captain Albert Zertucci here. What I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to show you again how I attach the braid to the center of the spool without using any tape. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start by going underneath the spool here. And then I'm going to wrap it about 10 to a dozen times. Three, five, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. So there's ten wraps right there. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move it over, and then I'm gonna do a hollow core splice. I'm gonna take the braid back in on itself. And so with my needle here, I'm gonna insert it into the braid. And what I want to do is go at least a foot into it, take it back, so I can lock it in. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take my tag line around my main line, insert it into my loop or latch. You can use either, either one of the needles for that. Close it, and slide your braid over, pull it out on the other side. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to start my knot from back here and it comes around the braid. I'm going to soak it or I'm going to pull it out just a little bit so it ain't scrunched up right there. So I got a little loop. Now I'm going to keep pressure on this side and I'm going to suck all the little slack out of the line. And what I'm going to do there is basically I'm hiding the tag in. Ooh, I was close. I'm off by an inch. I can reinsert the needle or you can cut it and since I already got over 12 inches here you know you can like I said you can cut it or you can reinsert the needle I'm gonna go ahead and reinsert the needle on this one just to show you that it can be done so if you have too much you don't want to cut off you just reinsert it go further down Pull it through one more time and then again I'm gonna start from the, the base over here of my loop keeping pressure on these two fingers and I'm gonna pull it away so now that I've hidden my tag line what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna suck up the excess slack of my tag line and rotating my spool trying to keep it in line and you'll see it start to get fat right there well, that's the double-ended loop getting sucked in there. And so right there, it's already pretty much locked in place, as you can see. And watch, turn on the clicker. I'm pulling on the line over here, and it is not moving. But if I give it a little slack, it'll move the drag. That tells you that that knot is locked there. What I like to do is move it all the way to the right side of the reel, which would be your left side over here. And then relock it in. So that's how you tie your braid straight to your spool on a hollow core braid.